gentlemen, please welcome to the Senior Bowl Hall of Fame, Steve Hutchinson. And to present Steve with his Hall of Fame plaque, Keisha Davis, Director of Marketing and Community Relations for Mobile Gas. Um, thank you, Phil Savage, the Senior Bowl Committee, and Mobile Gas for this, uh, this award. It's uh, truly an honor to be here tonight. Uh, before I get started, I want to introduce my family who uh, made it with me, my wife Landon, my, my kids, <laughs> Luke and Lily. My in my in-laws, Kevin and uh, Belinda Brandell, and my wife's grandparents, Earl and Jolene, who came up from Pell City, Alabama. And uh, <laughs> Earl's a, a huge Alabama fan. I don't really know why I invited him, but he's he's here. <laughs> um, you know, when you think of the names that came through this game, it really is an honor. I mean, you, you talk about Brett Favre and every, a lot of guys I played with. It's it really is. It's it's a it's a unique class. It's an elite class. Um, I want to congratulate Tamba uh, and Coach Curry as well. Uh, Tamba, you know, he's the type of guy that I used to lay in bed at night wondering how I was going to block him every time we we played Kansas City. I'm, I'm glad. That's one of the perks of being retired. You don't have to worry about that anymore. Uh, Coach Curry, it's funny. We had this conversation out in the lobby. Um, my my first year starting as a redshirt freshman at the University of Michigan in 1997, we went on uh, to win the national championship. Um, it was also his first year's commentating uh, for, for ESPN, and, and one of his first games was one of my first games starting, and we were playing Baylor in Ann Arbor, and uh, as a freshman, he gave me uh, on TV the player of the game, and so, um, you know, I'd like to thank him for probably something to do with me being here tonight. Um, when Phil called me and, and broke the news a few months ago about being inducted um, and, you know, telling me about the, 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 the evening and the dinner and, and how much of a, a great program it is, and, and, and I really had to think back, um, you know, 15, 16 years in, in football, it, it, that's a long time, you know, you, you, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's an eternity in, in, in football years. And so looking back, I was trying to think of my experience over this week. And uh, looking back, really, I, I'd equate it, the Senior Bowl week, as a, as a player, it's a lot like going to the doctor's office getting a tetanus shot when you're a kid. Um, you, you, you know, it's, it's when you're a kid, you step on a nail, you run home, you tell your mom, I, 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 you know, what happened? She's like, well, we got to go to the doctor, and it's this big doctor, and you can get this huge needle put in your arm, and, and you're, as a kid, your eyes are huge, you don't know what's going on. Well, the Senior Bowl, it's a little bit the same thing. You play your, your last college game, your coach, your agent, they're telling you you're going to go here, you're going to be pulled in a million different directions, uh, you're going to be, you know, having interviews, you're going to try to, you know, boost your draft status, you got all these things going on and your, your eyes are like that, they're like, they're saucers, you know, you don't know what's going on and, and not to mention you have to play every day against the best of the best, the guys that are going to be drafted and and be the next stars in the NFL. So at the end of the day, you, you leave both places sore and crying, really. I mean, that's, that's what it comes down to. Um, but that being said, uh, what I did, honestly, all, all joking aside, take away from the Senior Bowl was I was, you really get thrown in the fire. You get indoctrinated quickly on how to be accountable, uh, and, and professional and what the next league is about and, and ultimately when it comes down to the, the whole point of the Senior Bowl is to prepare young men coming out of college and give them their best chance at succeeding at the next level and when you are pulled you know you know you got to meet with this scout at 745 at night and, and this one at 753 I mean you got to learn to tell people no and, and and do a lot of things and I think that's what I learned most from the Senior Bowl was if I'm gonna succeed at the next level 
I've really got to have my priorities in order. And this is, a, a, uh, this is as much of a mental preparation game as it is physical. And, and the week in Mobile for me really kicked that off. So thank you uh, all for this award. This is, uh, this is something special. I appreciate it.